Hi, so this is me making a vlog video with my handsome little tiny human there. Um, and I guess this is going to be about my son's progress since he has been in speech therapy. And I'm super, super excited. Um, so my son, he started speech therapy in April. Um, he didn't have any, well, he does speech, PT, um, and... OT, yes, speech piece OT. And um yeah, so he saw this in, in April and he didn't have any um words in his vocabulary whatsoever. But I am excited to say, like since he's been going these past few months, he is starting to say words, like he is starting to express himself. Um and I'm I'm so excited, you know, especially because I know there's a lot of moms that deal with this. Um, their son might have like a delay, um, just any type of developmental delay. And I mean, I just want to say to the people out there that are stressed out about it that, hey, there is light under the, at the end of the tunnel. I said under, at the end of the tunnel. Um, I used to stress out about my son not talking and stuff like that. And I worried about everything. I guess because, you know, being a mother, you worry about their future. You worry about when they, you know, when they go to school, you just want them to succeed no matter what. And that's how I am. You know, I want my son to succeed no matter what, you know, because, um, I'll go I'll go to war for that little guy like I really will I love him he's he's my world he's me and daddy's world and um but yeah like he he's been going for a few months and it's been I've seen a big difference since he's been going to therapy and um I'm super happy I'm um I, I'm obsessed with his progress um, his therapist, he loves all his therapists, which is a, you know, a really, really good thing. He loves all his therapists and, you know, that makes me happy. Um, he's, when he first started, he would cry whenever we left. So that's a good thing. Cause I know that he loved being there. Um, he's just so happy in the environment. And I mean, it's really, really, really a good thing because I feel like therapy in general has kind of, um, and I, I'm not even going to say speech therapy, just therapy in general. Sometimes it's like a taboo, like to some uh, people, like, I mean, they just, oh, oh, it, I'm sure he's fine. Like, just let it just, it'll, it'll um, run its course, you know, and, and sometimes it doesn't. Like, I mean, yes, yeah, sometimes it does. And people and kids do start talking overnight. Um, and, you know, I'm not faulting anybody that ever gave me advice, you know, just to kind of calm my spirit, stuff like that, you know, because thank you. You know, I appreciate anybody giving me advice or whatever, you know, because, yeah, some people's kids don't talk for a while and then they just literally they kind of they kind of start talking overnight. But this wasn't the case with Justin. He was too over. Um, he had just turned two and he still didn't have any words in his vocabulary. And it just kind of like didn't sit right with me. And, you know, me being his mom, you know, um, I'm responsible for him. Like, you know, say, for instance, if I never put him in therapy and he wasn't talking then I, I, I would feel responsible for that. Like, I would be like, okay, well, you could have got him therapy two years ago. You could have got him therapy a long time ago, but instead you waited. You waited for him to talk. And I'm just, I'm not that person. Like, I'm not going to sit down and wait, sit around and wait for my son to talk just because people told me, oh, it'll run its course. So, I mean, yeah, he just, he just turned three. Um, Sorry, my glasses keep falling down. He just turned three and um last last week and um yeah with him turning three he he is already having words in his vocabulary. He's only been going there a few months and I'm so so happy. Um I'm so thankful for the therapist. Um he goes three times a week, so that's a lot for him, that's a lot for me. Um, but I mean, it, it may, it made a big difference. Um, he's still picky, of course, can't, he's still a picky eater and they do have a food school there. They do have food school, which, um, his therapist kind of said that he wasn't ready for food school just yet, but, um, but yeah, I mean, you know, we'll get there. Um, 
I mean, it just takes patience with your child. It takes time. But, I mean, they will, they do get there. It does get better. Um, so, yeah, I just want to motivate a mom out there that's kind of going through the same thing. Um, and just, you know, just be patient and just continue to love them. Keep doing what you're doing. Um, and it'll it'll get better. But, yeah, so... Oh, and then before I go, yeah, he we, he's going to therapy um, here in Hawaii. Um, at um, he's going to Sprout Sprouts Therapy. Um, so I'm just I'm super thankful, um, super happy, and yeah, what he's just being he's being, he's cuddled up under my mommy right now. I don't care what Daddy says. He's a mama's boy, <laughs> but yeah, so. Um, yeah, it light lights on the lights under the end of the tunnel, so you just have to be positive and be patient.